And we're underway here in our finals at 197 pounds. We have Phil Wellington from Ohio University. He's in the black singlet and green ankle band. He's facing off with Sean Scott from Northern Illinois. He's in the black singlet and red ankle band. Wellington had an impressive victory over Colin Moore of Ohio State in the semifinals. Scott had a victory over Michael Wolf of the Naval Academy to advance to the finals. Scott has had an impressive way to the finals here today, upending Mark Martin of Ohio State 6-4 in the opening round. Second round, he had a victory, a 5-3 victory over Garrett Leinberger of Notre Dame College, who is a Division II national champion, before upending Drake Stein of Purdue, 9-2, and defeating Michael Wolf of the Naval Academy in the semifinals. Wellington has a tech fall, an inju injury default victory, and a, vic a decision over Colin Moore in the semifinals. With a quick takedown there against Scott, he takes a 2-0 to zero lead. Just about halfway through the first period. And he lets him lose. 2-1 to one lead for Phil Wellington. Wellington getting some fakes in here. Wellington getting some fakes in. Trying to post on the head. Both guys moving their feet extremely well thus far in this bout. And a beautiful snag single for Scott. Wellington does a great job getting his leg back and sinking his hips, not allowing uh, Scott to score. Ref's gonna call a stalemate, get him out of that remote position. Eight seconds on the restart in the first period. end of the first period, Phil Wellington has a 2-1 to one lead over Sean Scott of Northern Illinois. Scott gets a choice, and he's going to go bottom to start the second period. Scott does a great job getting his feet right away, getting the escape. Less than 10 seconds into the second period, he ties about a two to two. Northern Illinois has done a great job of putting a, a great tournament together as a team. They were champion at 141. Now they have another uh, opportunity for a champion here at 197 pounds. Wellington has looked impressive all day, as well as Scott. Both guys have had very difficult roads to the final. Wellington's going to get the two-point takedown. He's going to jump out to a 42 lead. One minute left in the second period. Scott gets to his feet and Wellington's gonna cut him loose. 43 lead for Sean, excuse me, 43 leads for Phil Wellington.
The ref's going to call a stalemate there and warn the wrestlers for interlocking fingers. Your champion is And a nice shot by Scott, but Wellington just feeds him his hips right away and gets his, gets his leg back. And right again, Scott's in on a shot, but Wellington gets his hips back once again. An impressive showing of defense for Phil Wellington here so far. Scott has got him extremely deep. As I, Wellington gets a shot, and, and Scott uses his defense to score the takedown. And he's gonna take a four a five to four lead going into the third period. <laughs> Wellington has been in control this entire match and a one takedown for Scott. He's got a five to four lead headed to the third period. Wellington's gonna choose the bottom position. issue with Scott getting set, ref gives him a little freebie and Wellington up to his feet now. Got to get his hips out here. Scott's going to cut him loose. Five to five bout. Riding time still not a factor in this match. Takedown is going to potentially take the victory here in this bout. Nice high crotch by Wellington. He's going to scoop behind and get the two-point takedown. An escape for Scott. It's a 7-6 battle. Scott takes a shot. Wellington's going to get his get worn for stalling here. That could be a big factor in this bout if Wellington doesn't stay on the attack. 7-6 match, 50 seconds left. Wellington in the lead over Sean Scott of Northern Illinois. Wellington gets his hips back. They come back up. Wellington's got an underhook on the right side. He circles out of it. Wellington fakes. Come on, Phil. Northern Illinois coaches will tell you Wellington's grabbing on the fingers. Six seconds left. And Phil Wellington's going to be your champion here at 197 pounds. And a great victory for the Ohio Bobcats. Wellington's going to be your champion, 197 pounds, the MSU Open. <laughs>